The children of Israel wandered in the wilderness for 40 years before entering the promised land. It took 40 years to build the Salt Lake Temple. During the flood, rain fell for 40 days to cleanse the earth. 40 days. 40 days. 40 days. Jesus fasted 40 days before he began his ministry. 40 days. 40 days. 40 days. 40 days passed between the Savior's resurrection and his ascension to heaven. 40 days. 40 days. 40 days. We have been challenged by President Russell M. Nelson to find and take names to the temple. I've learned who my own ancestors were. I better understand where I come from. We can help you find a family name to do your own ancestors' temple work. Our families will be blessed by taking our family names to the temple. Elder Neil A. Anderson said, as you seek to contribute to this sacred work, both by finding those needing ordinances and then beginning their work in the temple, your own knowledge and faith in the Savior will increase, and you will receive a more certain witness that life continues beyond the veil. I'm excited to once again challenge our awesome Lord to do this 40-day temple challenge, so much so that I even rearranged my desk so that you can see this awesome picture of the temple behind me. I can promise you that as you participate, not only will your faith and your testimony grow, but our Lord will receive many great blessings as well. President Russell M. Nelson taught us, your worship in the temple and your service there for your ancestors will bless you with increased personal revelation and peace and will fortify your commitment to stay on the covenant path. Remember that this is a challenge for every member of the ward, so that includes you if you're listening to this right now. I love you, and I'm excited to see you in the temple on February 23rd. We want you to join us in the temple.